Now we've got a big announcement from Walmart. Elizabeth Schulze sat down with the CEO of Walmart U.S. and joins us with that story. Looking forward to this, Elizabeth. Good morning to you. Good morning to you, Robin. And you know, it's been years since Walmart opened a new store. The retailer's focus has turned to sales online, but it is now making a multi-billion dollar investment in new locations across the country, betting big that brick and mortar is a big part of the future of shopping. This morning, a major expansion by Walmart, the world's biggest retailer, announcing it will open 150 locations in the U.S. in the next five years. The first time it will add new stores since 2021. It's really about providing flexibility for the consumer. We Walmart U.S. CEO John Ferner telling GMA the move reflects a new era of shopping, where customers first shop online and then order or pick up from stores near them. What we know is being close to the customer is helpful not only to the customer, but it's also helpful for us in terms of delivery. So some of this is having an actual almost distribution center where people can get deliveries if they put an order online on Walmart's app or on Walmart.com. Yeah, it really is. Walmart also making a big investment in its workforce, awarding store managers higher pay and stock grants that could bring their salaries to $400,000 a year. It just makes sense that um, given the size business, they're managing super centers like I did 25 years ago, and they're managing an e-commerce business. The retailer says artificial intelligence is already shaping its day-to-day -day operations, like by keeping track of how much inventory is left and where it is in the store. Is there a risk that that AI might replace some of those jobs altogether? You know, over over time, um, we believe that we'll have more jobs than we do today as we continue to grow. Now, the jobs will change. So we see this as, as a way to improve productivity, but more importantly, to help associates upskill, learn new skills, and, and perform at a different level. It hopes AI will benefit customers, too helping you search for terms like football watch party on its site instead of individual items like chips, plates, or decorations to put in your cart. If you haven't tried it, try the new search tool and just say, um, you know, what do I need for a Super Bowl party? And I think you'll have a lot of fun. AI in your day-to-day -day shopping there. But Walmart's US CEO told us that he also sees inflation improving. He admitted that grocery prices for a lot of shoppers still going up and down, but said the company has been cutting prices for other general merchandise products. That is, of course, much welcome relief for a lot of shoppers, guys. It really is. And it's great to see the increase in the salaries. $400,000. That's yes. a pretty significant salary for a store manager, guys. That is well-deserved. Okay. Thank you, Elizabeth. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.